Hello, so I'm Alex and I work in the retail department here at Pride Veterinary Centre. Uh, we've got a great selection of collars, harnesses and leads for your dog, so when you're getting out and about walking with them, we can make sure that you're safe with them and they're not going to slip out of their harness. So we've got a resident dog, Poppy, who's been trying on some harnesses just to show you how to make sure that they fit your dog correctly. So you have a simple harness like this, which goes over the head and then around underneath the belly. It's a really simple harness if you don't want lots of complicated clips and things um, and it lead attaches at the back so it's nice and simple it's nice and padded and you can get it in a range of colours as well this is another style of harness which is super comfy and you can see how padded it is so it's really popular with people dog's head goes through here legs either side and around the stomach again when you're fitting these you want to make sure that they've got about two fingers can go underneath the neck and again around the stomach so it's not too tight but it's not loose enough so that your dog can slip out of it at all. Again another Walters harness here that comes in a range of colours. Dog's head through the front, foot either side and up against around the belly and it leads from the back. Again these ones are really flexible and adjustable and it's even got an adjustability underneath their chest um, so if you've got a longer dog or a shorter dog compared to where their rib cages are this one can be a great fit for a lot of dogs. This Holti harness is fantastic, it's one of my favourites. It's great for dogs that pull um, and it's really adjustable as well. It's also great for puppies, so when they're younger and obviously they're growing at a rapid rate compared to when they're older, um, it's so adjustable that hopefully it will last them through to being a young puppy through to when they're an adult and getting their proper fitted harness. So this one, again, it adjusts underneath the stomach, around the neck and around the waist has a handle on it and it leads from the back. So this harness also doubles up as a coast control harness so it stops dogs from pulling. It has two access points to be able to clip the leads onto to give you that extra security. This is our last style of harness that we have where the dog simply slips its legs through and it clips over the top. These ones are really popular in the hospital when we've had any spinal patients or any patients that have got any eye issues because it reduces the pressure on them so they're very popular um, for recovering patients as well. Nice and simple and again they're quite adjustable so if you have got a dog that's in between stages this can be a nice option to make sure that you're not having to replace your harness too often.